dragon temples are looking to the east, but this one is looking to northwest, exactly to the peak of the mountain. So they connected the old cup of mountain with their deity here. And in Christianity period, as I mentioned, in 7th century AD, the Christians from Arabian Peninsula, they came and created monasteries. And we know from the Byzantine records, late Roman era records, the priests were coming or the pilgrims were coming and they had a pilgrimage up to the peak. So they continued that tradition for, so for thousands of years, the peak taken as a holy place. And so I am one of the worshippers of the mountain. <laughs> Today it is still continued. And about Athena. So she was the goddess of knowledge and goddess of strategic war. Mm -hmm. How she was born is an interesting story. And the story says, before getting married to Hera, Zeus was married mm -hmm. with another goddess. Mm -hmm. She was called Metis. Mm -hmm. And Metis was the <coughs> goddess the of wine. And one day, Zeus learned from the destiny that if Metis would give birth a son, that son would be would take the throne from Zeus. He already made a plan. And one day, Metis appeared with the good news. He's pregnant. But Zeus already arranged everything. He said, you have to prove you love me and that child is mine. And you need to do some tasks. And ask her to change her body into different things like a big monster, a mouse, and at the end he said, change into a drop of water. And she did. And at the end Zeus drank her. After a while, a terrible headache started, and he called his son Hephaestus, the god of the iron seeds and asked him to crack his head with his hammer. The priest was, was so scared, but he did. And from the head of Zeus, Athena was born as an adult lady in her armor. So, uh, Zeus indeed gave birth twice. The other story is related with Dionysus. He was in love with a mortal lady, but one day Hera found out that she was pregnant, and then Hera told the lady, okay, he's not Zeus, he's telling the lies, and asked him to show himself with everything of him. That was including the thunderbolts. And the lady asked, Zeus said, you will die, but lady insisted, and Zeus showed himself with everything and one of the thunderbolts killed the lady but Zeus took the infant and put infant on his upper leg and after a while Dionysus was born from the leg of Zeus and that was my first life <laughs> <laughs> so you can take pictures and then afterwards we will continue.